back off the wall, everybody. We're going to keep the competition just the way I like it, nice and hot. And I'll tell you, the scores right now are the blue team with zero points. That's all right. The gold team has 100 points. So the gold team is a little bit ahead, and just because I've got a heart and I really feel for the blue team, I'm going to make every single game in this round worth 200 points. Very easy to catch up. And just because I want to remind you guys about the whole point thing, the double trouble player is somewhere still lurking up on the wall, and he or she, if beaten, is worth in this round 400 points. You gotta pick that, you gotta find that person. We still have seven video challengers left to choose from, and it looks like the blue team is up next. <laughs> Hello, Gina. Hi, Larry. So, um, you can do some cool impersonations and sing with your voices and things like that, right? Like what? Like, what's your favorite scary movie, Larry? <laughs> <laughs> Choose a challenger. Who would you like to play against off the wall? Number nine. Number nine. Whoa, look at that guy. He's scary. Let's go ahead and meet him. Hi, what's your name? Sean. How you doing, Sean? Pretty good. Pretty good. All right. Well, Sean, tell me a little bit about yourself. What's your favorite hobby or activity? Uh, football. Football. Oh, my goodness. I have been waiting for you. I have just a game for you. Sean, trust me, you are going to really get a kick out of this. What do you think? Cool. Gina, are you ready? Yeah. Then follow me. Right over here. All right. So, we've got some footballs right there. And we've got a goal post right over there. And that's because you're playing the Dizzy Spinning Soap Goal Kick to Dizzy E. Heist. All right. So what you're going to do is, when I say go, you're going to pick up this bat, put it firmly on the ground, and then punch your head firmly on the end of the bat, and spin around it five times. One, two, three. Okay, whatever. Anyway, you get the picture. Spin around it five times. When you're all done with that, hopefully you won't be too dizzy to wander over here. Grab one of these balls, place it into this tee, and kick it over that field goal. Okay. Do you have any questions? No. I didn't think so. You're smart at this. All right. So go ahead and hold the ball right there. Remember, don't go until we stay here, right? Okay. This is worth 200 points. Everybody count down with me nice and loud. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, go! One, keep going. Two, keep on the ground. Three, keep going. Four, one more. Five, go, go to the wall, go to the wall. Keep going. Get it over the thing. Hurry, get in there, get in there. Oh, oh, keep going, keep going. Oh, so close. You made you a little dizzy. No. No. <laughs> All right, that was a great try. You can keep the football. Why don't you go back over there and hang out with your team? <laughs> Go team is up. Hey, what's up, Steven? How you doing? Doing good, doing good. So, Steven, uh, you, I heard you're a pretty good cook around the house. Yeah, I am. Uh, yeah, this one time I tried to heat something up in the microwave, but I forgot to put it in there, so uh, the microwave blew up. You blew up the microwave? Exactly. Did you turn it? Did it make you buy, buy a new one or what? Uh, she was pretty mad, but she didn't really find out. You have a nice mom then. Yeah. That's cool. All right, I'll tell you what. It's your turn to choose the challenger. Who do you want to pick off the wall? Uh, number four. Number four? All right, let's go up and meet that face. And you are? Valencia Hurt. Valencia, nice to meet you. Where are you from? Washington State, Marysville. Oh, Marysville, that sounds great. Tell me, way up there in Marysville, have you ever had any trouble facing a challenge? No, I face a challenge pretty good, I guess. All right, Steven. Are you ready, bud? Follow me over, man. Right here. All right, so you've got a good-looking face, and we've got some good-looking stance, and you're going to play the... Disney face on with console enhancement. So when I say go, you can take these stamps one at a time, lick them, and stick them on your face. Whoever can get the most stamps stuck to their face in 30 seconds is going to win. Do you think you can beat your video challenger? Yeah. All right, how many stamps are sticking at a time? One, two, one. One at a time. All right, remember, this is worth 200 points. Everybody count me down. Here we go. And five, four, three, two, one. Go! Go lick him, lick him, two hands. Use both hands. Stick him on there, one at a time. There you go, stick him, stick him. Lick him, stick him. Got it. 
Keep going, keep going. You got 20 seconds left. All right. Your video challenge is using the nose. Touch the nose. Forehead, nose, forehead, forehead. Get him on there. Looking good. Wet your tongue. Wet it. Keep going. Come on. Oh, this is a vigorous competition. If anybody's dead, here we go. Four seconds. Keep going. Keep going. Two, one, zero. That's it. That's all right. That looks good. Well, this one is on at times. This one counts. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Great job, man. All right. Let's see how your video challenge it. All right, let's see how many you've got going to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, whoa, whoa, thirteen to the mouth, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. Fantastic. Oh. Good job. Oh, Steven. Awesome try, man. You gotta beat your video challenge though. You're tied. So close. Great try, bud. Good awesome. It's all right. All right, that was the end of round number two, and the scores are the blue team with zero points. And the gold team in the lead currently with 100 points. All right, blue team, now don't worry because we're going into round number three, and this is our head-to-head -head challenge. Now, this is the only time in this show where our final two players are going to be competing at the same time against our last video challenger. Now, very important, guys, pay attention to the scoring. If you beat your video challenger, you're going to pick up 300 points. And if you beat your opponent as well, you're going to receive another 250 points. That makes 550 points possible coming up right now. And now, the time we've all been waiting for, let's get our final two players to center stage. Come on over. Come on over. Come on over. All right. So, Shalami, Shlomi, and, and Renata. Yeah. If those aren't the raddest two names for a head-to-head -head challenge, and in this corner, Shalomi, and in this corner, Renata! You know what, though? There's one small piece missing to this challenge, and that's your video challenger. Eric, how's it going? Oh, uh, it's going great. You having fun today? Having fun today. What grade are you in? I'm a senior. Now, I need to ask you some pretty personal questions about your eating habits. Has anyone ever called you a pig when you eat? <laughs> yes. All right. Guys, did you eat lunch yet? No. You have it. Good, because when you're done with these, you can probably eat these crackers. But first, you have to play the piggy bank pylon with padded padlock. <laughs> and mouth frenzy, too. Mouth frenzy. So what you're going to do is when we say go, you have to put all these crackers from this plate into this piggy bank. And the only way you're going to do that is with your mouth. 